Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Tyrone back with Tech Life. And I want to caution you as the consumer, as this article makes its, makes its rounds across different platforms. So it's, this article started at Bloomberg, and now I'm seeing it in the Seattle Times and in, in, in other, in other uh, news outlets as well. Verizon lost its network superiority. Now it's paying the price. And the reason I want to caution you is I still want you guys to, as a consumer, remain objective and, and test the network that you may want to possibly switch to. Because it may not, this, what you're seeing here in this article may not be reality. And I've seen this happen too many times where some people switch to, say, T-Mobile in their area where they had Verizon and T-Mobile just doesn't work as good. That is still the case. So you got to look at the reality of it. Verizon still has the larger network. If you look at the crowdsourced maps, if you look at individual user experience, they will tell you, hey, I went to this national park or I went to this remote area and only Verizon worked. That is still the case in 2022, and it will still be the case in 2023. So as you've seen these articles say, Verizon lost its network superiority. I just caution you to at least test the other networks. You could test AT&T through Cricket. They have a test drive. T-Mobile has their 90-day test drive. And if you have an eSIM-capable device, I highly recommend for you to test it before you make that entire switch. Because you don't want to switch, get into new phones, possibly new phone numbers depending, and then it doesn't work for you. And that, that's what these types of articles create. When the average consumer sees from a credible source, hey, Verizon lost its network superiority. T-Mobile's cheaper, let's go with them. Since, they're, since Verizon's longer the best, somebody else has to be, or at least on par. So that's what that creates. It creates that conversation at the dinner table where T-Mobile may be an option because it is cheaper. People are trying to save money. And since Verizon is claimed to have lost their network superiority, let's try someone else. So like I said, I highly caution you guys to make sure that you thoroughly test the network that you that you want to switch to before leaving Verizon because it may be the best choice in your area still to this day. So make sure you guys stay tuned to the channel. Like, share, subscribe, follow my social media outlets. This is Tyrone with Tech Life. I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace.